Hello, good internet. Um, today I'll be asking some questions for the Flat Earthers. The Lunar Eclipse, the Blood Moon, and the ISS. First, I'll start with the Lunar Eclipse. According to science, this occurs when the Earth passes between the Sun and the Moon, thus the Moon moves into Earth's uh, shadow. Sometimes, uh, this even causes the Moon to turn red, due to the Earth's atmosphere acting like a lens. The atmosphere refracts the Sun's light, and only the red light manages to project onto the moon, thus illuminating, illuminating it in a dim red color, while the other frequencies of the electromagnetic spectrum, or the visible ones anyway, are uh, scattered away from it. Uh, now, the Flat Earthers claim that the lunar eclipse is caused by another celestial body that is completely dark. I must ask, though, where is the evidence for this claim? Surely there would be some other evidence that said celestial body exists. The only thing I can think of in the universe that cannot be seen is a black hole. And maybe dark matter as well. Uh, and I'd, so I'd certainly hate to be close to a black hole. Dark matter? Uh, that probably wouldn't be very good to come across a huge clump of that either. It'd probably tear you to pieces. Uh, the blood moon is one that flat earthers have absolutely no answer for other than the quackery of claiming it's a hologram. I hope that they know that the hologram technology does not exist. The closest thing we have to it is either projecting an image onto a piece of plastic that's at an angle, like what they, uh, they did with the whole Tupac hologram, um, projecting an image onto spinning mirrors, or projecting an image directly into both of your eyes, all of which would be absolutely impractical and damn near impossible to use in order to fool you into thinking the, the moon is red. I also doubt there is a projector strong enough to turn the moon red, and especially not thousands of years ago when the, there were reports of it happening then, too. Unless you want to say something like time travel, which, yeah. Uh, lastly, the International Space Station. The greatest structure ever created by human beings. First of all, I've seen the International Space Station fly over my head quite a few times. Uh, it just looks like a white dot moving slowly across the sky, but with binoculars or a telescope you can pick out the details. So it exists, it's not fake. Secondly, how can you explain the images brought back from the ISS? Just yelling, well that's a fake and that's a hoax and the CGI doesn't cut it with me. You'll have to prove to me that it's fake. And so far, nobody's been able to do that. So, Flat Earthers, can you answer some of these questions for me? Or explain some of these things anyways. They weren't quite questions. I didn't phrase them in questions. Um, so, uh, yeah, peace.